Yeah, buddy, John here from Empire RV and Marine, and I've got a 2011 Keystone Montana fifth wheel. It's a 34RL four slide uh, unit. I'm going to take you on a uh, video tour to show you guys the uh, the product here and show you the type of condition it's in because a lot of our customers uh, come from thousands of miles away to buy from us, and I want to uh, show you anything that uh, uh, that you need to see before you get here. Um, it's actually got a great floor plan. This awning here is a power awning. Now I do want to point out that the uh, the awning material right there is starting to tear. Uh, so the fabric will need to eventually be replaced or replace it now if you want to. Um, it's not a huge uh, deal. It's a pretty simple process. You just got to buy the, uh, the material for it. Uh, you've got a huge basement style pass through storage here. It's even uh, got the cable satellite hookups, 110 outlet. Uh, but a huge amount of space it's lighted in here um, but yeah tons of storage space there and uh, you've got of course your entry door here nice huge slide out I love the fact that the uh, got the nice large windows on the slide out and then you've got the uh, aluminum wheels down below here um, as you see the uh, the slide out here has the uh, the nice uh, slide topper up, up above it and then uh, towards the back You've got the roof access ladder. Um, do make note that the uh, that you see this is off the uh, track here, as well as down there. I have still uh, been able to climb up it, but uh, you'll need to get that uh, fixed. Uh, I love this huge, uh, big back window here. I mean, when you're inside, you'll really appreciate that uh, window there. It's even got a little mini uh, tow package uh, down below, so that's kind of nice. You can do like a bicycle rack uh, carrier. Uh, something like that. I think it tells you what it can carry here. Yeah, it's not a very strong one So just just little things like a bike back and then also uh, you have 50 amp service on this So you're gonna have the two rooftop airs. It's also got uh, Stabilizer jacks down below here in the back and then while wow, we're down here I don't know if you guys can make that up, but there's a spare tire carrier sitting right there now on this side You've got the other three slide outs four slide outs total each slide out as you can see the slide toppers on it And they're in nice shape and uh, while I'm here, I want to point out that uh, one wheel is mismatched. Okay, it looks like they had a uh, blowout one time and it damaged this skirt here. Uh, our parts guy should be able to order that uh, fender skirt still. Uh, and then that, I haven't actually crawled up under there, but that uh, wheel might be the matching wheel that it needs. But I uh, just want to make sure you guys know that the wheel here on this side is mismatched. Uh, you've got a nice security light up top there. All the decals. They look really good. I mean, they're not all uh, weathered or cracking like you see on most of them. So, I mean, check that out. Looks really nice. Um, you've got hydraulic slide outs on this rig here, which uh, you control from inside. But I just wanted to show you that you can turn on and off uh, the slide if you want to. Um, actually, let's go ahead and make our way to the best part, which is going to be the inside, which I think you're going to love. Uh, if you have questions on it, feel free to call me. My name is John. Number is 936-253-8130. It's got a uh, triple step entry, a nice big uh, grab handle, and then again, it's a Montana 34RL, which RL stands for rear living. Um, so now that we're on the inside, first thing you'll notice is this great kitchen. You've got the uh, four-door Norcold fridge, and a uh, really nice solid surface countertops and check out all this storage I mean even down in here you've got underneath where the sink is look at all that you got all that great storage here I love the u-shaped kitchen it's got a, a three burner uh, gas range and the actual oven below some more counter space next to the stove here nice microwave as well as some overhead cabinets up here and then plenty of storage up in here too I mean, look at this that is so cool tons of storage in the kitchen a nice little uh, 110 outlet here for like a coffee pot um, and then you got these huge oh that's cool so you get the sink cover and cutting board in here I didn't know I had two same deal on this side Let's see. yeah same deal on this side that's cool okay so you got nice deep deep sinks and then you've got the uh, the solid uh, countertop covers uh, and then now where we are now is the uh, the living room area 
It's got these two fantastic recliners, and they are rockers as well. I don't know if they rock. Yeah, they don't rock with the uh, pedal still out. Let's, but see, now they rock. Pretty cool. All right, I got a call coming in. I'll have to decline that for now. Uh, I love the overhead cabinets. Tons of storage on this thing. This kitchen uh, table, it's extendable. I mean, you can... There you go. Shorten it. Make it bigger if you want to. It's got the four seats right there. Uh, you got a beautiful sofa back here as well as a nice little computer desk area you've got your TV here lots of lots of overhead storage a nice ceiling fan as well the AC is going to be ducted so make sure you make note of that and then as well over on this side you've got space for a washer dryer system it's already plumb for it or you can use it as like a nice little closet space I mean plenty of space for a closet actually and then if you guys haven't already seen I forgot to show you all this storage right here next to the fridge. Tons of storage. You've got a uh, a sliding uh, window here. I mean door here to separate the bedroom from the living space. It's got a huge bed. Okay. Mirrored wardrobe closet there. You've got a Jensen uh, flat screen TV. Lots and lots of storage in the bedroom. Um, and here's some more closet space. It's got another cable satellite hookup thing there, which is cool. All right, John here from Empire Army Marine. I do apologize. Uh, my battery went dead when I was filming in the bedroom, so we're going to go ahead and start uh, from this point here. I don't even remember exactly where I left off, but I know we were in the bedroom. And I just want to point out you got a huge bed here, a nice flat screen TV, vanity area here with a sink below it, of course. Lots and lots of nice storage. You've got even more storage here. You've got a large mirrored wardrobe closet here. And then uh, I think I pointed this out, but we're going to show you got a lot of nice uh, shelves here, as well as even a drawer down below. And all the cabinets, all the woodwork on this, it's actual nice solid wood, not the cheap, cheesy like particle board stuff. Uh, I've got the bedroom AC here. You've got duct uh, air in the bedroom as well. The headliner on the unit is great, uh, but I just want to show you this closet space here. It's got a nice nice place to hang some uh, coats or jackets or whatever you want to close close wise and then you've got this huge glass shower enclosure here with a nice generous size so you got even a little mini tub down below doubt you'll ever use that but it's there uh, the nice nice good size shower though um, and then over here to the left you've got this space to do your business okay you got a fan up there it's got a nice mirror Good looking guy does not come with the trailer, sorry. Um, and then also there is, if you want to separate, you know, because you've got the partition. I don't know where I'm filming even, sorry. You've got this partition that can separate the bedroom if someone else wants to use the shower and you don't want them in your bedroom. So that's kind of nice. As well as there is another sliding, uh, sliding door in here that will separate the whole entire bedroom from the living space so you can have all that to yourself um, it's got fantastic vent fans on it you've got your slide out switch all right here light switches all that good stuff um, if you're interested in this unit feel free to call me it's a super nice floor plan I really really like it 2011 Keystone Montana 34 RL it's actually in really nice shape I mean really nice shape so if you have quite the carpets let me show you super clean uh, it doesn't uh, so if you have questions on it feel free to call me number is 936-253-8130 I'll be more than happy to go out to it and take more pictures if you need it um, or uh, just any questions you might have feel free to reach out to me I, I answer the phone pretty much every single time I can our number again is 936-253-8130 and you're looking at a 2011 Keystone Montana 34RL with four slides and I appreciate you guys watching this video